TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN headline news update. Good morning, everyone. 10 a.m. Tiger Financial News Network, Wednesday, the 16th market update. We're looking at the Dow up 16 at 32,611. My contention here is that for the last four or five days, I've been saying upside at uh, 33,900 is very strong or should be strong resistance. I don't know if it will be. It has so far. And that we're in a digestive phase and we should see some uh, a little breather taking place here. Certainly in the Dow, you're looking at the S&P. So the Dow is up 25. The S&P <clears throat> is up. Uh, oh, now it's down. It's down 20 at 39.72. It got it stalled right at the 200 period exponential moving average. And we're going to see whether or not it can hold the 39. Oh, I'd say 39.62, 39.58 is the key support today. Let's see what happens there. We're looking at the QQQ NDX 100 down sharply, down 2.7 at 286.65. I had a really nice strong move up to a leg D, probably a PD today. And look at the weekly chart. Got stuck right there in the Chapman Wave inside track repellent zone. It needs to get to the 297 uh, area. And quite soon to break out, IWM, the Russell 2000, is trading down uh, to also 2.7 at 184.90. And it's made a peak F slash C. It's right stalling the 200 period exponential moving average. You're going to have to watch that one carefully because 181 will be key support. Looking at gold. <clears throat> Gold is stalling at the 200 period. Moving average is still very strong. All the technicals are very good. On balance volume is a little overbought. So it's down a fraction, down one at 1776. A uh, leg B, and that's very strong. Weekly is also very strong. Look at the dollar. The dollar tried to find some support. It's a little bit better today. It's down 27 ticks at 106.13, holding above the 200 period moving average of 105.61. We're going to monitor this for the next few days because I do believe we're in just a little digestive phase right now. Looking at crude oil, crude oil is down sharp. It's down two and a quarter at 84.63, and that's what we've been talking about. We've been talking about possibly crude oil stalls over here. Looking at the TLT, we'll talk more about this when I get back for the Tiger Technicians Hour in a few minutes. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. We're looking at um, the TLT up 76. It hit 100, and uh, it's in leg C to the upside. It has a little more to go for that resistance. I'll be right back. Stay tuned.